Oh my goodness, I want to get out of the frozen tundra here. This is absolutely ridiculous. By the way, welcome back to the long drive where, oh my goodness, uh, diesels are trying to kill us. Uh, by the way, Maxwell uh, is up on top uh, looking out for some good stops. And yeah, we're, I mean, we're completely stuck. Also, my goodness, that sound is driving me nuts. Uh, the motorcycle is clipping through the back of the bus and it sounds like my tires are screeching. Uh, it is not the bus. It's the motorcycle doing that. Uh, but yeah, if you recall from the last episode, we were, oh my goodness, there's a stop up here. Yeah, we were struggling to get up into these mountains and it's bad. Like, this is the most unique uh, map seed that I've seen so far. Like, I mean, we're just seeing all sorts of crazy stuff. We found a mass. I can't slow down, by the way. I'm, oh my goodness, I'm hitting my brakes fully right now. Look, I am on the brakes. Uh, I think the road actually is slick. I can't slow down for this stuff. Watch out, buddy. Oh, uh oh, oops. I think we just hit one. Um, can we get an F in the chat for the bunny? All right, well, I guess we, we aren't stopping at that stop. <laughs> No, this is great. I'm, I'm frozen inside of a freaking bus full of... Oh, I guess I shouldn't be bad. It's cats. Oh, I'm out of fuel. All right, pull it over. Let's go get the barrel out. Oh, my goodness. Well, at least we're pointed downhill, so I should be able to roll. Uh, but that's what it looks like up there. That's the stops that we got. We got another mountain to climb up. Oh, who would have thought that getting to day 100 was going to be this challenging? By the way, you guys can hit the thumbs up button for some more uh, long drive. I think I got to get the barrel from the top. Okay, well, I'm gonna eat some breakfast. We got some uh, bacon here. Uh, hello, Maxwell's. Uh, there's Maxwell number one. He gets the trophy. Uh, all right, we're gonna put that back there. Uh, yeah, it, it's been a, a handful here, uh, but we're, we're fine. Everything's good. Wait, what's in this one? Oh, we got diesel. I got a little bit of diesel in here. I might as well go ahead and use this too. Uh, by the way, we did swap to the bus motor. Uh, oh, I made a poo in my seat. That's gross. Uh, yeah, we swapped to the bus motor. Uh, it really has, I feel like, helped us uh, get up some of these mountains. I don't think the V8 motor would have been able to do that. Uh, here, let's put this in here. Oh, I think it's already done. Uh, we'll just put that. We'll make it like a trip hazard for another car. All right, I'm going to go get a little bit more fuel. Uh-oh, I hear a rabbit. No, no, stay wherever you're at. Just, just, just leave me alone. I, I've had enough here today. Look, that tow truck can't even, like, make it up the mountain here. Shows you how treacherous the road is. We don't think we can move this thing to try to make it be less annoying. Okay, collisions are off again. Wait, the noise stopped. Oh my goodness, it started again. Well, it kind of stopped. Are we good? Oh, I hear something. Is there a vehicle outside? By the way, it's so neat having this little mobile base. I, I want to build more onto it. Like, that is a legit thing. Uh, we just, if you recall the last episode, we dealt with mountains the whole time. There were not really many stops. So, yeah, that, that was a thing. But I'm hoping our luck changes today. Either that or we're going to be stuck in snowy mountains for the rest of the episode. Uh, but as I was saying about the seed, uh, it's the way the world generates. Uh, my particular one, I need to post it to you guys. Uh, I think a lot of people wanted to kind of follow along. I mean, you're really far behind right now. <laughs> uh, don't worry, I have like a 80, 90 day like head start on you. But yeah, it's been, what was that? Oh, it's a bus. Yeah, it's been interesting. Uh, we found a gigantic crater uh, last episode. Like, it's something I've never seen in the game. It was like the perfect little crater. Oh my goodness, look, a diesel. Yo, that thing's in pretty good shape. By the way, there's normally ammo at the top. It's like, there's always a revolver. I really don't need one. I did want to pull over and look at that. That is a fantastic looking diesel. I mean, the tires are kind of poopy, but I mean, the body itself, that's in good shape. I would take it, but I'm committed to the bus for a little bit longer. Uh, maybe in the future. Uh, the bus, I still want to build the back. I talked about building a shelter. Like We already have like the interior done, but I need to put a shell on the back of it. That way it could be like a cat shelter uh, for the top of this thing. I feel like that would be pretty cool, but yeah, uh, let's just keep going. I'm going to try to get up this mountain. This uh, It's not going to be fun going up that road. I am curious what is beyond this like how in the world do we keep climbing like there's gonna be like every time you climb there's going to be a drop where's the drop at and how big is it gonna be and is it gonna kill us uh, there's a chance that happens this episode so stay tuned uh, we'll see if we can get through these mountains together and we'll see what the other side looks like because I am genuinely concerned what the road's gonna do I'm gonna laugh it's gonna be like just a straight drop uh, that would be absolutely hilarious. Like, in my head, uh, I'm going back to my childhood, like in the 90s when watching SpongeBob. I always think of Rock Bottom and how they had to jump off 
it was like basically a straight down cliff to get there like that's what i'm picturing is what we're gonna find here today uh, i'm kind of hoping i'm wrong thankfully the road doesn't go up to the right because that goes up even further like i don't think we've ever been this high in the long drive that sounds weird i don't think we've ever been this high up in the long drive uh by the way there's a taxi riding my butt hey get, just just go around i'm clearly slower right now I'm hauling a lot. I got Maxwell's. I got a bunch of stuff in here. I've pooped my pants. Just leave me alone for today. I just got to get over this stupid hill. Okay, we've made it to the other side of said hill. It's getting dark. It looks like, guess what? There's another hill. Oh my goodness. I just want to hit my face against my steering wheel. Does it honk? It honks, right? Oh yeah. That's what you're going to hear. Like, my face is going to be stuck to the wheel, and I'm just going to roll by and roll off the cliff. Like, we're not going to make it to day 100 at this point. <laughs> okay, we got another climb. Do we think it's going to be a drop-off on the other side, or is there going to be another climb behind this? Oh, my goodness. Okay, come on. Give him a score. Give him a score. I'm thinking that was a solid 8. They stuck the landing. All right, 8.5 there. That was impressive. I've seen more air with the AI, but as far as just pure landings, that was pretty good. Uh, is that an oil tanker? I would go off the road, but I feel like there's a chance I might get stuck. I haven't really tested out the ice a lot, but if it's anything, anything like when the road goes downhill, like if I go off this cliff, there's a chance I'm not getting back up it, and we're going to be just off-roading it here, trying to get to the other side of this mountain. Also, I had to laugh at my comment section. I had somebody tell me, why don't you just go around the mountain, Komodo? I mean, how am I supposed to go around this mountain? I don't know where the mountain actually ends, and then if I go around it, there's a chance I might not find the road again. Oh my goodness, it's going back up. It's going up and to the right now. Okay. Well, at least the turbo is pulling up. I am so glad you guys taught me into at least switching to the bus motor. Uh, that was a good idea because I, I don't feel like the V8 would quite pull. Like I feel like the V8 has a better top speed, but when it comes to actual pulling up hills, uh, it's, yeah, it's pretty weak. Uh, definitely doesn't need to be in a bus. So I'm at least glad we're doing that. All right, here we go. What is on the other side? I swear if it's another hill, my face is good. Oh, you have got to be kidding me. We're climbing up the mountain still. All right, I'm driving through the night here. I feel like we're wasting days by just driving for a little bit, going to sleep, driving, going to sleep, especially when we're going this slow. Like we're not making progress. We're not getting to mom's house at all. All right, well, I'm gonna keep my foot pinned down to the floor and let's hope not to fly off the mountain. I mean, if it gets like, too treacherous so i'll go to sleep that way at least i can see during the day but uh it's fine the uh the road is well lit now uh, let's just hope it eventually starts to go down because i'm absolutely tired of snowy mountains here hey look it's a sign of hope we're going down yo okay we got some speed now look at this i mean it looks like it's gonna go right back up because there's another gigantic mountain beside us or we're gonna go down into this little valley here uh, i'm kind of curious uh, stay tuned to figure out my goodness, I feel like I've done nothing but complain <laughs> the first... <laughs> How long have I been recording? I've only been recording for like 15 minutes, and I feel like I've done nothing but complain. My editor's probably tired of hearing me right now. But you know what? It's what you get paid for. Actually, no, you actually get paid to edit. You don't get paid to hear me complain. Oh, my goodness. Okay, we're going down the mountain now. Oh, no, no. Okay, those are bumps. Those are... Okay, just gun it. Okay, aim back for the road. My goodness, how do we not fly off? Here we go, back up on the road. Oh, <gasps> okay, I had to double check. My heart just dropped. I was like, there's a Maxwell on top. No, Maxwell is still riding up towards the front. Uh, hopefully Maxwell is like physics locked or something. I know it wasn't physics locked when it was on the bed. Oh my goodness, just aim for the lights. I think it goes right back up to another mountain. You've got to be kidding me. Look at that. It goes down to the bottom and then we climb up a mountain again. Okay, I can't even see if they're stopped. Oh, this is dangerous. Oh, well, you guys wanted to make it a day 100. There's a chance that's about to not happen. Okay, you know, just gun it. We're committed. I need to keep the momentum up. Oh my goodness, a car just spawned in front of me. You're gonna have to get out. The get out the way. Get out the way. I'm honking my horn. Come on. Ooh, jeez. It's a race. Look, the biome even changed back to grass. But we're gonna go right back up to another freaking mountain. Okay, wide open, wide open, wide open. Ooh, it's bouncy. Okay, I think we're good. Is there any stops down here, by the way? I don't see any stops. Oh, we should pull over. But let, let's pull over. We're gonna die doing this. I at least wanna see my death if this happens. Okay, brakes. Brakes are useless right now. Okay, handbrake is on. We're going to bed. I am not about to die at night. I wanna at least see it. Now, that guy, on the other hand, brave little tow truck driver. Oh, he just disappeared. Never mind. I was gonna say he's got the uh, he's got it all figured out, but we got more mountains to climb tomorrow, folks. I'm going to bed. So, folks, look at this. Look at what we're surrounded by. It's nothing but mountains. Like, we've just found, like, this little... Wait, what was that up there? Is that it? I don't know what kind of stop that is. Ho hold the phone. 
I mean, it's a stop that I don't think we'd be able to get to. Oh, no, wrong one. There you go. Uh, let's get our binoculars out. What is up on the side of the... Is that a diner? Oh, it is a diner. I would love to go to a diner right now. It's such a good stop, but there's just no, like, physical way we actually get to the diner. Like, there's no way we're going up the side. Um, anything else? Nope, it looks pretty empty. What about on the road? Uh, watchtower. Oh, no. What happened to my stops? Look at that. That's the road. It's just going to wind up the mountain. I don't see anything along it, though. And then it goes up and... Oh, oh my God. You know, if we could get that diner stop, I'd go there and I would just cancel the series. I mean, when I say cancel it, we're just going to like live out our remaining 100 days in the diner and just eat their food and then hope that we don't run out before 100 days. Like that That's what I'm tempted to do here because this is, man, this is bad. Well, 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 look at this. Uh, we're going up another hill in the long drive where, oh my, go look, even the Fury is having issues. Like, I was like, oh, if I was in a Fury with a big V8 motor, I'd be cruising up this bad boy. But look at the, a okay, come on. This is about to be the world's slowest car crash. Get get out the way. You're going to make me lose mo- Do I have a gun on me? You're going to make me lose momentum. I- Get out the- Get out the way! Just- Just move! Well, that kind of encouraged them, didn't it? Wait, dude, they literally turned and went up the hill now. Uh, oh, I might be able to miss. Uh-oh, my bus is stopping. My, my bus, what do we do here? Folks, uh, I mean, technically it's moving. We're moving at like 0.1 miles per hour. Or for your kilometer uh, people that most of the world actually uses that instead of our dumb American. Uh, what is it like, I don't know, 0 0.05 kilometers? Or would it be more? Maybe it'd be more. Maybe it'd be like two kilometers or something. I don't know. Um, I don't think we're getting up this hill. Like, yeah, the bus is officially... I don't even think it's actually... Mo is it moving? No, it's not moving anymore. Okay. I'm going to shut the vehicle off. We got to reevaluate what's happening here. Uh, I need to... Man, now might not be a bad time to get the motorcycle out and scout ahead. Hold on. Let me walk around to this side. Let's see if we spot... I mean, I could go down this mountain here. There is a stop down there. I, I don't know if that is a... Is it a bus depot? It is... Oh, it's a convenience store. Imagine opening a convenience store in the middle of the uh, snowy desert. So, here's my dilemma. Let, let me look this way. I don't see a road on this side of the, the mountain. So, I could go down and around... I can't go this way because all you're doing is climbing. My only concern is I think this road goes above this hill and maybe goes to the right. So we're going to have to try to find the road. So this is a very pivotal part of the series. I'm going to drive down this mountain, go down into the cliff or the val valley here, and we're going to have to do some off-roading and hope that the terrain isn't terrible down there because if it is, we're, we're done. Like, I mean, we could obviously continue the series just without the road, but I, oh my goodness, I really don't want to continue it without the road. Like, I want the road. I mean, you could just drive straight and run into stops. Like, I'm sure we would actually survive, but like, I want to actually, I mean, I kind of want to reach the end. I don't know. We're not doing that in a hundred days. Like, everybody's been asking me, well, what are you going to do in a hundred days? And I was like, I really don't know. Like, a part of me just to complete the series would be like, oh, we're done. But I don't think you guys would like that. So I'm still debating on how this series, if there's going to be a wrap up at 100 days, that's if I make it, by the way, or if like something's going to continue. I'm not really sure yet. Also, this, I don't think I've ever seen a mountain like this before in the long drive. Wait a minute. Hold on. Does the road? Oh, it goes to the left here. You know, we might be able to follow along the road just being on the side of the mountain like this. I mean, we're certainly making up a lot more progress than we were trying to drive up the road. So we got that going for us. This is also, I mean, the game's not stunning. I mean, it's kind of an ugly game, if we're being honest. But sometimes the terrain generation, like when it happens, or if you're looking at the sunsets, the sunsets in the game and the sunrises are beautiful. But I honestly, I, I do like the way the terrain generates here. Like this is a full blown mountain. Like there's gonna be times where it's gonna be flat and there's gonna be nothing happening. And there's gonna be times like what we're in right now, which is honestly really cool. All right, well, I'm gonna keep driving up the side of this mountain and hope that we come out the other side. I, I look forward to flat areas. I'm so tired of dealing with snowy mountains. Well, looks like we're gonna get around here. Hold on, we're back on the road. Dude, we just skipped that part. Okay, well, I mean, at least we know the bus can handle the off-roading sections. Uh, somewhat. I don't know, like, all right, we're obviously going back up, but looks like we're gonna turn back off the mountain. 
I don't know. I'm hoping this is the last mountain. I'm hoping when we look over, like, it's just going to be empty uh, after this. Oh, on. We're struggling again. But also, we're about to have to pull over. Uh, I need food and water. So, I might camp at the top of this one here. Uh, if I can. Am I being followed? It's really hard to see out the back of this thing. Uh, obviously, I have the windows blocked off somewhat. Uh, I've been having people tell me to put, like, a car door here in the front to protect myself just in case, like, a technical were to show up and start firing at us. Not a bad idea. Uh, okay, come on. You're almost there. Almost to the top here. Okay, looks like it's gonna start going down. You know what? We're gonna camp here for the night. Uh, I have, I've had enough. Uh, also, we're just gonna drink my big bucket of blood here. Make sure our life's up all the way. All right, let's eat and, uh, drink some water here. Uh, you know the fun thing is I can't actually go to sleep right now. I, I guess we slept so late the other day that, yeah, I have to keep driving. Is somebody passing? Oh, that's creepy. Yeah, imagine being on a, like, a snowy mountain by yourself and then a car just pulls up and stops. Oh, should probably, uh, probably clean those out. That's... Yeah, I mean, I, I'm in that uh, I'm in that mode of like, you know, I don't have time to pull over to go to the bathroom, so you just pretty much go to the bathroom on yourself. All right. Oh, well, really? We're gonna race now? Just get the heck out of here. Just, just go, go. Wait, do you have sliding doors? I mean, I would probably ride if you had sliding doors. If you have those normal doors, I don't want them. There's something else behind. Oh, is that a technical? No, I think that's another taxi. I hope it is. Uh, you don't need a technical bouncing into you because it's just going to open fire. All right, well, I guess we're driving through the night. Uh, I'm assuming it's past midnight, so, Editor, you can go ahead and show what day it is. Uh, it's the next day. Yay. <laughs> so, I want to welcome you to... Wait, was there a stop back there? Oh, there was a stop behind me. I didn't even see that. Um, welcome to the worst hill ever. I can't go any further. The AI are slipping down the hill. All right, looks like we're going off-roading. The only problem is now, it, I think the road does go to the right, so eh, we're probably screwed. We're probably really screwed. I can't make it up this. I mean, the, well, the taxis are kind of making it up. <laughs> oh my goodness. I've never been this miserable driving in the game. Okay, if we stick to the side of the mountain, it, just, just go around it. What? <laughs> You know, it's all going to come back to the comment that kept saying, just go around the mountain. Well, you know what? We're finally doing it. We're going around it. I, I am tired of the mountains. If I lose the road, I lose the road. So be it. I'm hoping I don't, but I can't stand going up anymore. Like, it, it's just, if we were in a different vehicle, yes. But in the bus, no. I mean, I would think that it'd be kind of cool to take the, the motorcycle, but I can't pack all the cats in there. And if I abandon the cats, I know what my comment section is going to be like. It's going to be a big dumpster fire. So I like the cats. I'm keeping them. I'm not abandoning them. You, you don't get your pitchforks out. It's, it's going to be fine. Okay. Um, oh, wait. Is that the road? That's the road. That's the desert. Oh, my goodness. I think we're finally going to get out of here. Holy man, this has been, I mean, this has been a journey. Like, I tell you what, this is, it's not been pleasant, but I see the other side. You know what's really weird is that we've climbed a ton. So even if we get into this desert biome, that would still mean that we are well above, I guess you can call it like sea level. Like, we are really high up in the sky right now. Uh, oh my good. Uh oh. Why is it lagging? Oh, I guess we're jumping the road. Okay. Just just hold on to it. Let's we're almost through. Just push through. You know what I do wish we would see? I wish the snowmen. And I think there was a mod for it to make them like reappear in the snow biomes. Like we would be dealing with haunted snowmen right now. Right now. Which I why don't I have that mod enabled? Honestly, I kind of miss it. It was so creepy because like there would be a ton of them out here and only a couple of them would move towards the vehicle and try to murder you. Yeah, that was a uh, fun times. All right, well, it uh, looks like we're finally going to get to the desert. I don't see any more ridiculous climbs coming up. Uh, just some minor ones. So uh, let's get out of here, why don't we? Well, would you look at that? That is salvation right there. That goes directly out into the desert biome. I was really afraid. Like, what if the road would pop like a U-turn or just it'd be like a hairpin and it goes right back up the mountain? I would be so angry, but look at that. That We could see the road. It's in the desert. Well we survived my goodness like i feel like that's about as hard as it's gonna get right like i mean day 100 should be easy from here uh, that mountain was just pure chaos oh wait okay hold on uh, i'm now lagging why what you know it's like when you just talk about the game being hard and that you know oh d did we just finally get through what we needed to get through the game throws a curveball at you and flings you through the sky i'm not even going for that back bike tire i have tires on my current bike Okay, uh, let's just aim for the road. I'm not going back up. My goodness, this game is trying to murder me now. 
You know, it's kind of funny. And this is going to sound bad. Like, you know, I was so happy about the desert. I feel like the desert road is the same road. It just, the biome changed. Like, I feel like it's the same mountains. Look, it goes right back up. <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. I feel like the game is just being cruel at this point. <laughs> <laughs> there is a stopover to the left. I mean, oh, never mind. It's just a, a little like red tower. Uh, I missed one stop. I mean, technically, I've missed two this episode. One, I couldn't slow down for. One, I legit just didn't even see it at night. And yeah, this is there's not been any stops. I mean, at least I think the road's gonna have a little bit more grip going up this. Uh, so let's see what's on the other side of this hill. And hopefully, it, maybe it's just a diner on the other side. If there was a diner, I'd be so happy because I can get a lot more of the supplies that I need uh, for the top of the bus. Plus, it's always, like, a really good stopping point. Oh, I, I hope there's a diner on the other side of this. Like, there was a diner up on the mountain over there, so why would there not be a diner over here? Well, when you go up, you must go down. It's just, it's literally another hill. Where, is there any stops along the road here? Maybe there's one behind, like, something that we're not seeing. Because, yeah, it's just, it's just dangerous roads right now. I feel like I'm going to need a break after this. My goodness. Uh, all right. Uh, hold on. We're coming up to... Okay, there's going to be a little drop-off here. Maybe there's a stop on... The, well, I, maybe I should be ready. I'm going to start letting off. <laughs> this kid's got to slam on the brakes. Uh, do we have a stop down here? Mm, no, there isn't. Oh, pleasant. <gasps> yeah, this has been great. Oh, my goodness. We are... Okay. This might be the fastest we've gone in the bus so far. Oh, oh my goodness. Okay. Uh, we're we're flying. There's a stop. Okay, stop. Just loaded in. My goodness. Uh, wait, where'd it go? Okay, it's right there. It's behind a hill. All right, just slow it down. Handbrakes on. Ooh, come on, come on. Oh, it's like one of the worst stops in the new pack. You've got to be kidding me. Well, you know what? It's a stop nonetheless. All right, we're shutting off the vehicle here. I have uh, I've had an adventure. I've had enough today. Uh, we're gonna break this open. See what's in here. Maybe there's a Maxwell kit. Oh, I was about to say, that'd be the ultimate reward, like, if you come to this stop and it's just Maxwell Cat. Nope, we're going to have a couple fluids in here. You can't actually open this. Well, at least I don't think you can. I've tried getting, like, a crowbar to hit these and see if you can open this up, but haven't had any luck. Oh, look, it's about to start raining. But as you can see, um, road doesn't get any better, so we're going to be dealing with this for a little bit. I don't know how long. Uh, not really getting many stops. Uh, the stops kind of suck. Uh, and then the stops that are good are just way out of reach because of the whole fact we're in mountains. So yeah, uh, it's been an excellent episode. That's, that's all I gotta say. I could dig that up, but wait. Okay, hold on. If I don't dig this up, somebody's gonna be like, well, there could have been a Maxwell in there. And you know what? I'm not gonna risk that, so we're gonna dig this up real quick. Uh, nope. Okay, try not to whack it and destroy it. Okay, come on. Maybe it's like buried treasure. Uh, so I think if you hit the Maxwell, they might explode. Could you imagine how comical it would be if the series ended with me hitting a crate and then it exploded? Okay, hold on. Let's just, just sit back. Yep. That's about how this episode's gone. It's uh, There's a radiator in there. Not even a Maxwell. I, I can't even have that go right for me. We'll see you guys next time.